So I've opened up OpenOffice. I click on Text Document. I want to create a, a text document. And now I have to create two new page styles because I want one page style for the first page APA style that will have the words running head, left margin, followed by colon, and then an abbreviated title in all caps, followed by the page number on the right side of the header. So, and then the subsequent pages, I want them to be just the abbreviated title and the page number. So in order to do that, I go to Format and Styles and Formatting. What I want to create is a new page style. Uh, and I'll start with mm, first page as a model. I will make a new style based on that. And I will call I'll, I'll call it subsequent APA style page. And the next style I want I want the same because I want these pages to have the same header. And I will go to the header tab, put a check mark in the header tab because I do want a header on that page. So now I have to create the first page. Uh, so uh, I can go to this icon here and new style from the selection. So I'll call this first page APA style. Okay. And first page APA style. I'll click on the right mouse, mouse button to get the modify menu. I'll mark modify. I want the header. And I'll click on the organizer tab. This is the name I have given to this new style. And the next style I want following this first page is subsequent APA style page. Okay. So here we are. We've created our two styles. So now this first page I have here I want it to be in the first page APA style. So I go here to choose the style. I don't see it there, so I click on more. And then I choose the different, these are paragraph styles, character styles, frame styles, page styles. This is what I want. So I want first page APA style is what I want for this page. And I will write in right away what I want on in this header. So I will want running head colon, and then I'll just put in the uh, title in all caps. This is what I would write in. Then I hit the tab key once and twice, which will bring me to the right side. And this is where I will insert the page number. So I go to Insert, Fields, and I choose Page Number. So I now have my first page and my only page right now. Okay. So I want now a second page or a subsequent page, which will not have the words running head, but will only have title in all caps and the page number. If I don't create a new style on the next page, if I don't choose a new st the other st the subsequent APA style page for the next page, I will keep getting this running head. I'll show you. If I press Control Enter to create a new page, I will not get the. Uh, first page style. I will get the subsequent page style because you remember when we created the first page style, the next page was subsequent page. So automatically when I have a new page here 
following the first page APA style page automatically it is a subsequent page style so here I would have title in all caps and tab twice insert the page number insert two and now if I create another page by pressing control enter I will have page three page four with the same header as on the second page there will not be the words running head as there is in, on the first page and that's how I do it so now I just write my my paper um, and follow the formatting of the APA style guide uh, and I've got my that running head uh, already done in order to save this as a template for future use you can just save it uh, I would save it as a, a file and uh, you can save as a, you could actually save it as a text document or you could uh, save it as a text document template and call it uh, APA style running tab and save it wherever you want to save these I'll just save it on the desktop for now and there you have it so now you're ready to do your APA style paper all you would do then is go to your desktop click on your running head uh, template and away you go there you go